Hi, what you see over here, this is the new Darwin OP. Darwin stands for Dynamic Anthropomorphic Robot with Intelligence, and OP stands for Open Platform. This is a National Science Foundation NSF research project, which actually a company, Robotis, is going to be building and selling as well. It's a collaboration between Virginia Tech, uh, Romella Robotics and Mechanism Laboratory, and Purdue University and uh, University of Pennsylvania and Robotics, uh, Robotics the company, uh, together. So if you look at to the left, you can see these are all the robots that we developed at Virginia Tech. This is the famous Darwin series. We started this product since 2004, starting with Darwin 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. You can see the evolution of the robots. And then about two years ago, we've been getting so many requests from research laboratories and research uh, universities about they want to use these kind of research robots for uh, research and education and outreach. So we wrote an NSF proposal and with that we're, now it became a uh, R&D project. So the evolution ends here. This is the Darwin OP, open platform. Now the best thing about Darwin OP, it's truly open platform, open source software and open source hardware, meaning that uh, it's a PC based, which means that you can uh, install Linux, Windows, whatever operating systems, whatever programming language, LabVIEW, MATLAB, C++, Lua, whatever you want to do. Type of uh, research and robots. Many people want to know. Give yeah. me a cost estimate. Okay, so I want to make it clear. At Virginia Tech, we did the R&D with Robotus. We are not in the part of business. We're not making any money. So the cost wise, you probably need to talk to the company uh, because they're going to announce. But as far as I know, it's going to be a little bit over 8K for an academic discount. And if you buy it as a set of a number of sets, and if you use a RoboCup, I think there's going to be a significant discount. But the cost wise, you probably need to check with the company. In terms of the hardware, all the CAD files, assembly manuals, including the fabrication manual is going to be online for free. So you don't have to buy it from Robotus. You can build your own if you have the basic machine tools. Uh, so that's the best part of it. Also, another cool thing is we designed it as a research platform so it has enough torque and force uh, payload so you can uh, add new sensors, different type of computing platforms, so you can add more stuff to it for, to use it for research and education. It's a fantastic robot. I personally even haven't seen anything, uh, any higher performance robot than the Darwin OP. And as you can see, we are very, very proud of our baby Darwin OP. <laughs> I see the similarity. <laughs>